Fayetteville State University is positioned perfectly to serve our military students both on uh, military bases and here on campus. We are closely located to Fort Bragg. We're only about 10 miles away and we have an extremely large population of military students on our campus. About 30% of our entire student body population are military connected. So that's active duty, veterans, uh, National Guard, reservists, military family members, including children and spouses. Serving the country means a lot to me. It's a big deal, and I think it's an honorable thing to do for anyone that wants to do it. I think it's part of my legacy. A lot of my family members have served in the military, so I think it was just the right thing to do, and it was something that I was always destined to do. I think it's in me to do, just following in that uh, lineage and doing my part. Growing up here in Fayetteville, my dad was in the 82nd Airborne, so I've always had paratroopers and military members around me. When the time came, I was like, I think I want to fly. And from that, I've been able to gain a pilot slot, which is a really big thing in the Air Force. From that, I uh, plan to go over the Air Force decides to send me, and wherever they send me, I want to do my best and just carry on that legacy. Two individuals on this side, facing out this side of the road. Bravo team leader will then do the same thing, but on the near side of the road. And I believe that we do a very good job at creating tomorrow's leaders, not only with the different uh, trainings and different opportunities that are afforded to us, but by the amount of cohesion that we have and the amount of competitiveness that is in, this, in, in the program and the atmosphere around here. I chose FSU because I am prior service at Fort Bragg, so I was already established here. But I specifically wanted to come to FSU, Fayetteville State University, because it's a HBCU. I definitely uh, love the community, the minority community, and bringing that experience and when, what I gained from that into the Army. What I enjoy about the ROTC program is the competitiveness. And it also allows me to tie the technical and tactical proficiencies that are found in a leader and connect them with anything that I may have not known as prior enlisted. It also gives me the opportunity to provide leadership and mentorship to newer cadets. You know, I want to provide them with those tools to be successful. So in a, in a group like this with consistent prior service, with a, a population of underclassmen that need that enrichment, I think we, we have the clear opportunity uh, to give them that teaching, that coaching, that mentorship uh, to allow them to be successful.